Good morning everyone, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda A Link Between Worlds. In the last part, we fought Yuga, lost to Ganon, and wound up in low rule. In this part, let's take a look around. We just switched out. We can see there are new weather veins. Hilda is now talking to us to Sahasrila. Can you hear me, Hero of Hyrule? It is I, Princess Hilda. I wanted to warn you about the kingdom you which you found yourself. The rule may remind you of your own home, but in fact, our kingdoms are as different as night and day. Worlds apart, as they say. But Yuga's schemes has forced our two kingdoms close together. So close, they are now connected. What's more, the seven sages you seek are spread across my land, locked away in dungeons. But, because parts of Low Rule have long crumbled away, you cannot get to them from where you are now. To reach them, you must first find a way back to Hyrule. From various parts of your world, you can reach the same parts of mine. Now, one more thing. I have welcomed you to Low Rule, but my kingdom? It isn't so welcoming to strangers. Farewell, and be careful out there, Link. So, we will talk to this guy. A new weather vane, so we can still fly between them with the the um, broom. I don't know why, but running around with a sword like that, sheesh! Pour my heart and soul into crafting fine weapons, and folks still just battle with whatever they find lying around. So that's a good reference for later. But we can see on our map there are a few X's already, and that's just where. They think each of the sages' paintings is wound up. Also, that guy did indeed just insult the Master Sword. Um, so we can see one of these is already right here. Nobody gets past me unless you know all the words to the Ultra Secret Thief password song. Start with the lyrics and you finish them. Let's see, here you go. A smart thief fears the bo boss's wrath. I'd rather be walk be a on a cliff walking. Uh, a virtuous path, that sounds like. Sometimes it hurts too much to care. You think knowledge is power, but it's really despair. Every time I say I'm a leaving, this accursed life sets me right back to thieving. So the first one I think we got wrong, but the other two sounded right to me, so I'll, I'll, I'll just assume they were right. But we can look at the item shop, see what they've got in this one. Pretty similar to the usual thing, we've got the choice of a bee. I don't want a bee. A golden bee for 9,999 rupees. And a fairy. 77. I don't know why they're all double numbers, but whatever. Boss went and hid my thief girl away where no one could hear what she had to say. Sometimes it hurts too much to care. You think knowledge is power, but it's really despair. Boss locked her up somewhere and threw away the key. Why do you gotta go do that? Why? Okay, so it hurts too much to care. Knowledge is power, really despair. So that only looks like it's one of the lines. We should go looking around, see if we can find anyone else who'll sing the other two. So despair was the right answer there. Oh, we've got another weather vane. We want to activate these as much as possible just to try to link everywhere. Really, there's one area I want to go for sure, and it's this, like I want to do this one first. Also, I like that I can see a good chunk of money right there. But I don't think we can do much there. What's in this job? Oh, there's the captain. Are this, weren't there thing, things have fallen apart? It's thieves and creepy masked folks in this village. Nothing royal about this place. Uh, poor cuckoos, the cuckoo got smashed out. Oh, it's left the eggs? They won't. Nothing will happen. Yes, you do. Regular at the Treacherous Tower. Ooh, that's interesting. Unfortunately, it doesn't look like um, what we were after was here. I was looking for another person to give me more Thieve Song information. All we know is the Despair 
and um, this girl was locked up. Yeah, you can get a piece of heart here, it costs 200 rupees, and it's a random chance. So it's another place you're going to be spending a lot of rupees if you try to do. Fortunately, now that we've unlocked this area, we've got a little more chances for rupees. Oh, what's in this one? It seems to be locked. Well, alright then, that's not leaving us with too many options. But I do want to go through this entire town because I believe this is one of the more important ones. Veteran Thief, many years ago, I felt so free. Thought I chose the thief's life, but it really chose me. Every time I say a leaving, I'm a leaving. This accursed life sets me right back to thieving. So that's the other one that we needed. Strong musical culture is in this town. Well, so we have two out of the three. We knew the thieving, we knew deceive. Uh, sorry, we knew thieving, and we knew. Uh, what is it? Another part of it. And see, there is a path here if you want to be able to head back to, to the uh, light world or the other world, I guess, the way to phrase it. Mumbo jumbo, mumbo jumbo. Unfortunately, I'm not finding anyone else I can talk to to get that first piece. You know what? We'll, we'll talk again. Alright, start the lyrics. A smart thief. We're gonna go with a narrow path. Really despair and to thieving. What a fetching voice! So the narrow path was the answer. I, d I didn't find who was supposed to tell me that though. Instead, we enter this one and. Never seen you around here before. For new recruits, perfect timing. You can take over guard duty. Have a good one. Ah, so the bark was going to be where we got the last hint, I suppose. But there is, I guess, our place here. The boss door is right next to the entrance, and I oh, and there's the key. But we can't do anything to that door, so let's go the long way. Unfortunately, we have our shield. We need to do something to actually change the poles. Ah. Alright, so if we hit that switch, the... Oh, I didn't even mention. Welcome to the Thieves' Hideout. Uh, one of the first dungeons that we'll be dealing with. So, you can grab these statues and actually use them to push around. And those bars, while they would stop most, they can't stop you. So, you can just kind of walk your way through this area however you feel like. This is probably the only area I can think of that doesn't really have a requirement of any specific um, items. But it does have a few useful things in them, such as, um, well, these gargoyles. Um, and honestly speaking, um, the final boss is the easiest in my mind, if I remember correctly. So, push this here, block that one. We also want to grab and pull this guy. And since we've hit two out of the three switches, because there's always going to be more switches here than you can deal with. Sorry, I was about to sneeze. So you'll have to step on this one. That's all three switches hit and gives us access to the doorway. Break our way through these skulls, gives us a little more healing, and a purple rupee. This Thieves Hideout is a great place to start if you're needing money for purchasing one of the items. Like, I'm not sure what the next one's going to be, but... So, Quick Equip was also explained. However, I don't know enough about it, and I'd, I'd rather just um, use them all at the same time if I can. Well, I can go across these. I'm just gonna hop down, get this item. More purple rupees. There's gonna be a lot of money in this area, so I will be enjoying that.
Oh, okay. So, if you don't have bombs, they actually give you uh, bomb enemies that you can use. But, yeah. Fortunately, we do have bombs, so it's really easy for us to just kind of open this door anyways. And we got our first monster tail. I believe they only start spawning once you do get to this world. I don't know if they can spawn in the regular world now. As fun as that one is, I can't take that yet. And we need a key to be able to open this door. So we'll have to go looking for one of those. Uh, you know what, let's, let's at least go talk to, well, first this item. See, more monster tails. We get the compass, that's gonna really help us track down everything we need in this dungeon. All right, the boss went to hide a painting. So it's locked in here and he's gonna tell us, well, sorry, she's gonna tell us where it is. We step on this button, it's gonna unlock that next area for us. So you have to come in here. But, I mean, there's not much to do in here. We do get up the bomb again, so we can go in this way if we need to. And it does respawn itself. Following along this secret path, it, path, path, yeah, path, there we go, that's the word I wanted to use. We can get over to this next area and come on down to this. So, Unfortunately, these red ones you can now hurt with your sword. They just take a while. And since they can block each other's path, we have a chance at handling them. But once the five of them are down, which I still have no idea how many are left, if we had our lantern out, we would be able to see. And in fact, let's, let's pull it out. And you can see the bee is actually giving us a hand and, and helping us fight these guys. Whenever they spawn in, the bee is coming and attacking them. At least until it died. Which may have been from my sword, may have been from these right guys. So the requirement seems to be we needed the lantern. But, upon taking out the five of them, we get the teleport portal, which is nice. Gives a quick route back. And a small key, meaning we can unlock the only small key we've seen. The only small key door, I mean. We can't go that way. So let's just open up her door. Alright. Oh, thank you so much. You saved my life. Please take me outside. The painting you're looking for is hidden in the outskirts of town. I'll take you to it. Where'd you learn how to slide in and out of walls like that? It's a bit creepy. Maybe you can teach me how to do it. Okay, you have to hit A. And let's go down this way. Nope gonna lock us in there. We're locked in, check the northern door, see if you can get out that way. Well now that we're in a stressful situation, we've got the thief girl, and we are halfway through the thieves hideout, well, let's make our way to the surface. But that'll be next time. Here, you, you don't wait there. Yeah, you can have her follow you, and you can separate from her. But just with the pressure of A. But you gotta go right next to her to re-follow, so. We will continue this next time. Thank you guys all for watching, and have a good day.